Hello everyone, welcome back to Puzzle from Plays Hollow Knight. You're probably wondering, where the hell am I? I'm actually in Queen Station. Um, what I'm doing is I'm heading back up to town, um, primarily because I want to see uh, the lady behind the door we unlocked. Uh, if she will retrieve my body for me. Also, while I was coming through here, uh, I noticed this. I was like, oh, I wonder if I can get this item now. Um, and it looks like I can. Just make my way up through here. Careful dashing and wall jumping. Nice, yeah, and that is a uh, another mask fragment, so that would be pretty nice. It's actually our first in uh, in this section here. Um, yeah, so I want to go back up to town primarily. Um, and there's also that area um, after that, um, that bug mother boss. That someone mentioned in the comments that there was a... Uh, um, a place I can probably dash to or jump to now at this point. So we'll go back to Deep Nest at some point, but I think I mean, that's definitely somewhere I'm not supposed to be right now, would be my guess. So um, I'm going to see if I can rec uh, retrieve my money this way. If I can't, then um, then we'll just head back down. But it's a good time to find out. Because getting back there is going to be nasty. I don't want to just get myself in a death loop either where I just can't actually escape that area. Really? Hi, you are just creepy. Yes, okay. Barely visible in the tunnels of a deep nest deep below. That's interesting. She actually tells you where it is, too. There's a service. Yes, I do. A little bit of food. Yes, okay, so it is what the rancid eggs were for. I had a feeling that was the case. So that cost me 60 money, basically. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, jeez, and it just comes back and we have to kill it still. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, because that was like a lot of money. Um, obviously. So that's good. So it looks like whenever um, we need to, we can use that service um, to recover from a bad place. Now, I wonder, though... Can I still buy more rancid eggs or, um, okay, you, yeah. Or is that like a one-time thing? We're going to find out here in a minute. Anything new to say? Hmm. Gaining entry can be difficult. Only a few have managed it. Hmm. Now, it doesn't look like, because this is where it was bought, right? Yeah, so maybe I can find more, but... Uh, we will buy this. Have the money to do so. Gives us another uh, piece of the shard. Closer to more health is always very important. And, uh, yeah, why don't we buy this? Because now I'm kind of curious, you know, like... Um, will he get more stock, maybe? Yeah. You lost the key some time ago. So maybe we can find a key for him. Now there's also, um, I could potentially get back up into King's Pass now. If I can climb walls. Well, I mean, geez, there are just like a lot of places I can go at this point. Oh, can I get there? Oh, it looks like yes. I don't know if I should be back here, but uh, I can be back here. Yeah. The question is, what is back here? Oop. Um. Yep, I can hop up here. There is cocoon over here. Theoretically. And uh, that that place with all the spikes, I think, was actually here as well. Now, is this something I should be exploring? I don't know. Couldn't tell you. I don't know a hundred percent where that uh, that area was. Ooh. Oh, okay. Well, there's a secret here at least. What is that? Fury of the Fallen, huh? Another charm. 
Thinner lines do not hide your true form. Hmm. Oh, you know what? And this is this is in fact the area. Yeah. All right. So that's um that's the spiky section I was thinking about. So that's good. So we got that. I'll just head back out here. Let's check that what that charm does. Close to death, bear strength increases. All right. I'm sure there's more to explore in this area at some point, but let's uh, let's continue forwards for now. I also am using the Balder Shell. What's interesting about it is, um, you know, I can use it at any point. Um, I probably shouldn't have actually uh, rested there, but that's okay. Um, you know, I can use it at any point, even if I don't need the healing. And you can kind of give yourself a very brief point of invulnerability uh, without spending any soul power. It's kind of tricky, though. I was playing around with trying to time it, and uh, it's like a little bit of a delay. So it's it's not really a great immunity, but it's kind of an interesting idea. Hey, friends. Now it should be two worth, right? Yep, and we get another uh, fragment of something here. Oh, Grub Song. What? Gain soul when taking damage. Oh, and that only costs one as well. Hmm. Very nice. Now, that area with the, um... The Bug Mother, I believe, is all the way down to the right. Uh, I think it's where that bench is, actually. Let's take a quick spin that way. Uh, I do want to visit that shop again at some point, now that I have more money. See if I can repair my uh, my geo-collecting thing, and, uh, or if there's just, in general, ooh, more uh, more things to buy. But also like a uh, way to upgrade my weapon at some point as well. That would be kind of nice. Now I don't think we have a means of going to um, oops that place in the mine just yet either. Oh, gotta be careful when coming out of that shell. Uh, is it all the way down here? Yes, okay. All the way down to the right should be where I'm heading here. Uh, further down, though. Ooh, nice jump. I don't really need the soul charge, so... I missed the jump, so, well... So be it. Alright, where am I here? Okay. And further over. This was where the grub mother was. And the creepy laughing person is over here. There's a bench here. Yeah, so who are- Oh my god. Hi? Oh my god. Make yourself at home. Um... Salubra. Charm lover. Oh, charm store. What the hell? <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, Charm Seep's lifeblood constantly will certainly improve your constitution. That's interesting. Oh, a longer reach. Stay firmly in place. Increases the power of spells. Oh, charm notches. Oh, this is awesome. Quick focus. All right, so we definitely want to buy these. Oh, this is actually fantastic. Um, increased range sounds like it could be useful. 
Oh, once you own 18 charms of Gladys sell to you, you only need eight more. 25 charms. Okay, so we can't buy those yet anyway. I was gonna say maybe I should save money for those, but maybe we'll buy the long nail. I don't know if I'm gonna equip it right now, but um So this is a very, very important store. And in fact we can increase our charm level by buying more charms from her. What is that? I noticed when I rest, the little shell animates there. Okay, so we've got um I can equip one more charm and two more slots. Um, Star Wars Shell, Soul Catcher, Dash Master, Thorns of Agony, Fury of the Fallen. Long Nail might be the, uh, the one here. Um, is it much different? It's hard to tell, I guess. Let's actually, uh, use the bench as a guide. So if I stand at this edge of the bench, I reach the end of it. Uh, what happens if I unequip this? Oh yeah, I mean that is a pretty significant increase actually. So let's uh let's equip this again. Okay, nice. So now I think um we've got a few a few places we can go here. Actually it almost looks like there's an opening on the map over here. Just curious. Is there? Yeah, that's it does look like there's a path up there, doesn't it? Hmm. Now the real question is, am I going to be able to make use of that extra range? I'm not sure. But we can at least head over this way. And uh, maybe go to this other... Oh no, that was like a closed... Closed switch, huh? Let's go actually go up to the Stagway then. Find uh, a place to go here. Oh, essentially what I really want to do is... Uh, go back over to the Mantis Village, I think. I think that's the place to uh, to finish exploring at this point. I mean, this the world is basically my oyster at this point. I can pretty much go wherever the hell I want. Um, let's actually check the nearest Stagway, the Queen Station. Yeah, we can get there. Just see if I need to make a jump cut or not. We should be able to get there. Hello, friend. All right, let's head to Queen Station. And uh, it's actually probably. Do I have all of Green Path explored? It's actually probably a couple of places in Green Path I can get to now that I couldn't get to before. All sorts of things to do. I am pretty low on money, current time. So probably won't be able to buy anything from the other guy just right now, but... What I really want is something to upgrade the strength of my nail. Um, but that's going to be a little trickier to find, I'm imagining. Alright, so we might head to the right here. Do this, whoops. Uh, we want to continue going to- yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a couple of places we can go. There's a place to go that goes down from the Mantis Village. There's also a place that goes up. Uh, not quite at the Mantis Village, but near it. Oh, yeah, we're gonna avoid these things. So this was the kind of like the shortcut that we can access now with uh, the wall climb. Oh, you know what? Maybe I can't go here. Yeah, this was the area I couldn't quite get to. Okay, so we do need to go down in the Mantis Village. Ah, oh, jeez, I really hope I don't actually have to go into Deepness, because that place is just awful. There's already going to be some enemies here. Watch out for. Whoops. Like that one that I just walked right into. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to catch him before he caught me there. 
There's a path down. Yeah, this has big pit here. So where does this go to? Unexplored territory, basically. So there's a switch there. A lot of spikes around here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's gonna be a little dangerous. Oh, okay. Heading way down. Got it. Okay, that's another closed door as well. It's like I can do some clever climbing here. And this should open that switch. Okay, good. I don't know if there's much of a purpose other than that right now, but that is what it did, right? Yeah. It's another switch. You just kind of open up this whole area. Oh dear. Oops, some free money. Well, free might be a uh, subjective term here. Another switch. Oh, yep, saw that. As soon as I made that jump, I knew I was in uh, was in trouble there. All these switches here. Um, can I actually make... Ooh, you know what? I'm just gonna take care of you like that. Can hit this one through the floor. Uh, I would like to get all the switches open, though possible. Uh, is there one up there? Yes, there is. Now there's a few enemies down here. That's what I was hoping for. Didn't quite get the full combo there. You only take one hit now. Good, good, good. Oh, and there's a path over to the right. Hmm, do I want to go this way? Oh, you jerk. Guess I'm not going that way. So the hornets uh, respawn, but the soldiers don't. Does this reopen? No. Kinda playing a dangerous game just running past these here. If they eventually catch up to me, it'll be bad news. Should be able to go further down? Yeah, yeah, here we go. Oh, this looks ominous. It's like some sort of mantis council. Hi. Oh, challenge, huh? Oh, oh god. Um. I guess we don't have much of a choice, do we? Yeah, bring it. I like this music already. Whoa, okay, hello. You are very quick. So fast! Oh, just lost uh, window focus there for a second. Actually, didn't get my uh, heal actually off there. Boy, this is this is tough. Okay, okay. Kinda kinda getting the, the pattern here. If I can get a heal off. Alright, I got two there. Am I gonna have to fight all three of these? Oh. Oh wow, if you get hit by that, that's bad news. Alright, got one healing back. I am uh, I am in trouble.
I got the heal off, but uh Oh, is my um my balder shield broken? Does that have a limited number of uses per rest? I think it does. That's unfortunate. That's why it animates um, at the bench. Yeah, that's too bad. Okay, well I know that now. Uh, let's see. Oh, jeez. Should have rested at a closer bench there. Uh, I'm actually going to... I would like to do this boss fight before the episode's over, so I'm actually going to make a jump cut here and get myself back down there to a closer bench, so be right back. All right, here we are, back at the uh, the boss fight here. Let's try this again. Yeah, bring it on. I am a little concerned, though, about having to fight all three of these. That seems a bit insane. Mostly just because I don't do a lot of damage to them, it seems. That was unfortunate. That was also unfortunate. Uh, okay. I have to find a good time to, to heal. Gotta be- oh jeez, I'm just taking a ton of damage here. There we go, got three- three healing off. Gotta wait- yeah, that jump when they- when he leaves is tough. It's also tough to- to talk and do this at the same time, because good god. Oh, that's unfortunate. That protected me, but lost my healing opportunity. What health do you have, dude? That was not a good idea on my part. That one's, that one's kind of tough. Oh. I feel like he's getting faster, which is probably a good sign. Either that or my brain's getting slower. Oh, I gotcha. Am I gonna have to fight another one, though? Oh, no! Get out. I need to heal. I'm not gonna get to. Oh, that was my shield gone. Well, this is unfortunate. This is a little insane. Okay, I can. Ah. Can. Oh, what? They home in on me? Okay. Um. That's insane. Okay. Uh, let's let's give this another shot, shall we? Man, this this is definitely a uh, a difficult difficult fight. Not taking early damage, I think, is going to be really important here. Uh, not jumping straight. I'm not entirely sure how that picks higher or lower. I'm sure there's a like a pattern to it. Remember, each one of those is like three hits. Yeah, I'm not. I don't know. Maybe it always just goes to my position. That's... Oh, that was a terrible combo. See, that time it was high. I guess it's it's his position. He's up on the... on the side there, then it'll be high. I did get a heal off there. And another one. Yeah, it's, it's his position. That's exactly what it is. Kind of obvious, I guess, looking at it now. Uh, 
I, uh, I don't have a good strategy in mind for this next part, though. Next part kind of scares me a little. Gotcha, okay. Let's heal up to full. This is- I'm hoping that these two have less health. Yeah, this part is- is weird. That attack is very strange to me. Kinda just chose to take damage there. I know that sounds like a good excuse, but... Yeah, so that was the... the far toss. Okay. What's this one? Okay, this is the close one. That one's tough. That one's... I don't think I know how to dodge that. Oh, shoot. Here we go. No, no, no. Don't combo me now. These are getting very fast. Do this one. Okay, I like this one. This one I can dodge. Okay, don't do the other one now. I would like it if you would cease to live. That would be preferable to me. Okay, that's one. Oh! I got thrown off by that one sitting on the throne there. Is this just the same fight with just one of them now? Holy crap, I did it! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you damn well better, Bao. Respect indeed. Good god! So what is... I don't have a map. Whoa. Oh, this is Deep Nest. Oh, good. So I am going to have to... Oh. Can I get this... item somehow? Yeah, how do I... It'd be really nice to get. Um, so this must be the proper way to get into Deep Nest. I do not like this area, though. What also makes me wonder, you know what? Since I'm wrapping up this episode, I want to see if I can get through that door now that I, I have their respect, quote-unquote. Um, I get the feeling that has nothing to do with it. But um, I want to try to go into that room. Yeah. Wait. Oh, they actually don't attack me. Oh. Maybe this does let me get into that room then. Oh, they bow to me. That's very cool. Oh, and you're gonna let me through. Nice. Okay. Yeah, what's in this room now? This isn't just, um... Oh. Well, there's a bench here. Okay. What else is in here, though? I feel like there's probably something else in here. There's a treasure chest here. A couple of them, actually. Mark of Pride. Greatly increase the range of the bears now. Oh. This must be- I wonder if these can combine. That's a stronger version of the one I'm using. So it does mean I can always get the jump on these guys if I- whoops. <laughs> if I do want to attack them. It would not be the honorable thing to do, but, uh, you know. Hollow Nest Seal. Oh. Oh, that's another one of the, um, yeah, and I have two of those. Various. On the treasure chest. Whoa, that's a lot of money. Like, a lot of money. That was 600 monies. 
well. I think uh, I think I'll wrap up here for now. I might travel back off camera and just go to visit another merchant, but I think this will do it for now. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click like. It helps a bunch. Subscribe for more. See you soon.